In the rapidly evolving realm of AI-generated videos, the visuals are getting shockingly good. But the sound, the human voice, and its intricate dance with our expressions? That's been the sticking point. Traditional methods drop the ball, missing the nuance, the subtlety of human emotion, and individual facial flair. Enter the new kids on the block, Pika and Emo from Alibaba stepping into the ring with an answer to our animated prayers. What's their weapon of choice? Lip-syncing AI tools that don't just generate, they augment. Picture this. Pika, the text-to-video trailblazer, now debuts a lip-sync feature that keeps customers glued as competition heats up. For Pika, it's not just about looking real. It's about capturing the playful charm of Pixar-style animations and syncing them to the beat of our speech. Let's see some examples. God. I'll be damned. Is this real? Pika now supports lip sync, and it is truly spectacular. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. These things can talk? For real? What kind of dark sorcery is this? Mon Dieu, j'entends une voix. Well, I'm officially speechless. Giddy up! But that's just one side of the coin. On the flip side, Alibaba unveils EMO. Not just a feature, but a full-blown product making still images chat away convincingly. Over 250 hours of human speech, more than 150 million images, all served as the ultimate training buffet for this AI. The result? EMO doesn't just regurgitate text prompts. It crafts clips powered by the very rhythm of the input audio. Let's see some stunning examples from EMO now so you can decide which one is more realistic. Yeah, I think this is right now an inflection point where we're sort of you know, redefining how we interact with with uh, digital information. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's it's through, you know, the form of these AI systems that we collaborate. You wanna know how I got these scars? My father was a drinker and a fiend. And one night, he goes off crazier than usual. Mommy gets the kitchen knife to defend herself. He doesn't like that, not one bit. So, me watching, he takes the knife to her, laughing while he does it. He turns to me and he says, why so serious? When I was a kid, I feel like you heard the thing, you heard the term, don't cry, you don't need to cry. Crying is the most beautiful thing you can do. I encourage people to cry. I cry all the time. And I think it's the most healthy expression of how you're feeling. And I, I sometimes wish I just could have been told, you can cry. There's no shame in that. There's no shame. An AA with an AK melee finna set it like a play date, but a vacate retreat like a vacate mayday. This beat is cray cray ray J H A H A H A. Laughing all the way to the bank, I spray flames that cannot tame or placate the monster. You get in my way, I'ma feed you to the monster. Normal during the day, but at night turn to a monster. When the moon shines like ice road truckers, I look like a villain out of those blocks. You got me like We were cool, we were cool, can 
the dream that can be so We were right till we were Built a home that was deeper Quite remarkable, isn't it? There is no doubt that we will see more AI influencers, actors, and YouTubers replacing human presenters. These new tools are teaching us something vital. While AI has been busy conjuring up worlds from scratch, there's an equally powerful movement rising. The magic of augmentation. Rather than hitting create on a blank canvas, tools like Pika Lip Sync and Alibaba's EMO are adding a new layer of digital makeup, enhancing existing videos with a dab of AI innovation. It's not just a giant leap for content creation, it's a nod to the collaboration between human imagination and artificial intelligence, a duet that's just beginning to unfold its potential. So, will you join us on this journey to the next frontier of video production? The stage is set, and the world is waiting to see what we'll do next with these extraordinary tools at our fingertips. Welcome to the age of AI augmented reality. Please let me know in the comments which tool do you think looks better and whether you are planning to use one of them. And if you would like to see more content like this, please don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next one.